Thanks for connecting. And if you like what you hear, please share. I'm an advocate and, uh, you know, I'm excited about the opportunity for people to share their gifts, their message. And I think that everybody has an opportunity to do that. And so I started the pirate broadcast as a result of this, of my desire to share what other people are doing and my curiosity. So... Do you want to know how amazing people connect? Well, you're in the right place. Welcome to Marketing with Russ, a.k.a. hashtag Russ Selfie. Today's episode brought to you by Greg Bolton of Landmark Professional Mortgage of Albany, Oregon. Remember to think local, think Landmark. Also by Short Stops Burgers and Fries. Today for the best burgers and fries in town, go to Short Stops in Albany, Oregon. Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Marketing with Russ, a.k.a. Hashtag Russ Selfie. So great to have you all with us today. You know, I'm really excited about my guest today, not because he has the greatest name ever, Russ. I mean, you know, come on. And not because he has the greatest haircut ever, but because what a great guy he is. I just want to start off by saying hey to Russ. Hey, Russ, how's it going? Hey, Russ, and thank you for having me here. You know, it's uh, it's so much fun to have people with, you know, the slick haircut we have and the same positive attitude all in one and with the great name to boot. Um, and so we're going to talk a little bit about uh, what is Russ is up to in his pirate broadcast. And I'm so excited about that. I got a chance to be on that with him. But first, I want to remind you that I'm Russ Hedge. I'm a coach, motivational speaker. I'm an inspiration specialist. And I'm also a podcaster, obviously, of Marketing with Russ, a.k.a. Hashtag Russ Selfie, and the author of Befuddled, Live the Life You Choose. Here it is, right beside me, too. So there we go. And I always point the wrong direction on that. Let's see. There we go. Okay, I get the wrong hand going. There we go. So (laughs) really excited about that. The actual official launch date is next Tuesday, the 24th online, and you can get your copies through Amazon, booksellers all around the world. So anyway, I also want to remind you that if you want to connect with me, because I am all about connection, you can go to RussHedge.com. That's RussHedge.com. I try to keep it really simple because I'm a simple kind of guy. And on that are all the links to my social media and everything you need to get in touch with me. You can even schedule a time to chat with me right on my website and we can get together. I can learn more about you and I would love to meet you. So without any further ado, I'm going to turn it over to Russ and Russ, tell us a little bit about yourself and how you got to where you are today. Well, first and foremost, uh, thank you, Russ, for having me on the show and including me in this wonderful experience. And I'm, uh, I'm an advocate and uh, you know, I'm excited about the opportunity for people to share their gifts, their message. And I think that everybody has an opportunity to do that. And so I started the pirate broadcast as a result of this, of my desire to share what other people are doing and my curiosity. So I operate the pirate broadcast. It's a show that streams live five days a week, every single day uh, of the week on LinkedIn, YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter through Periscope. And also, uh, you know, I've been in this content creation space, the podcasting, the broadcasting content creation for a number of years. And uh, I've been in technology since, uh, and advertising since 1985. So I've been around a few days in, in, in some of these areas and just helping other people do what they need to do to get their message out, to be seen, to be heard, and to be talked about. So it's really, it's a really about how can I give back to the community now and how can I contribute? And I'm, I'm working on some several courses over at the Pirate Syndicate and bringing some people together and, and producing shows for other people and other organizations. So it's a really, it's an exciting time, even though we're running into a lot of challenges with 2020, it's really an exciting time to be alive and have this technology available to us, Russ. Yeah, I mean, you and I were talking about that. That is so true. I mean, what would we do without all the technology and ability to really connect and stay connected during this time? And, you know, I have 
really learn to thrive during this time with all the great tools uh, and keeping a good attitude. You and I talked about that. You know, really life is all how you look at it. And we're going to have stuff coming at us. And this year we've had more than our share. Uh, but it's what we do with that each day. And you have done amazing things. I love your themes. Kindness is cool. Smiles are free. That is my kind of theme of life right there. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, I also, you know, I was wondering because I almost came on with my pirate patch today, since I am a pirate, part of the pirate syndicate. But, um, you know, when you officially, uh, how many years have you been doing your show? Uh, well, the show, the pirate broadcast itself has gone on a little over a year. We're approaching 300 episodes and uh, lots of pirates in the community. However, I've been broadcasting uh, and podcasting since 2014, uh, live streaming uh, events and activities around. And I've got several different, uh, in fact, if you go to my YouTube channel, I, I think I have five or 600 videos over there. And and so I've been doing this type of work for, oh, probably six years. So well, yeah, keeps me out of trouble. I know that you, yeah, <laughs> I know that you, uh, you are sharing your wealth of knowledge with other people. I know that you've been involved in uh, several webinars and events, teaching people about podcasting and all of that. Um, and you said you've got some tools. You're helping people actually do that as well. Uh huh. Absolutely. Uh, yeah, I, I broadcast. In fact, I have a uh, broadcast actually scheduled for tonight at the time of this broadcast and uh, several clients that I help actually do live streaming. I produce their show. I help them with their social media. I produce their content for them and assist them to get online. And um, it's, it's really it's it's really satisfying for us to be able to assist people in getting their message out. When when you see everything come together and you can produce something that's quality content, you know you you know the experience. It's like every time you do an episode, every time you reach out and make a new connection, it's just kind of a little magic thing that takes place every every single day. So. I know I love the opportunity. I love that to be able to meet new people. I mean, you are an awesome guy and being able to connect with you and so many people all around the world has really just been a joy for me. Absolutely. Yeah. And, and, and as a result, we have friends all over the world and we just can continue to share a little bit of information, make those connections, start those conversations. And the next thing you know, you know, all of a sudden you have a few more friends. Yeah. And you know, you find all the commonalities you have with people, you know, people that outside of the technology we have today, we wouldn't really have been able to probably meet. Um, you know, the fact that I've made friends in Australia and Ireland and England and all across the U S and yeah. down in India. I just, my last, my last podcast was uh, with a gentleman out of India and so it's been just really interesting and it has been super satisfying. But one thing that I really enjoy about you is you have such a heart. And I know that um, in your situation, we have a lot of uh, commonalities um, yeah. with, with our moms and all the things going on there. And, you know, the fact that you're able to put your family first and do what you love to do all at the same time, I think mm -hmm. it's so great. Well, and it, it's taken years to design my lifestyle around what I find enjoyable. You know, not every day is, is rainbows and unicorns. However, every day is a choice to make the best of what it is. And, you know, that we've had several conversations around that, Russ. And, and it's like, you know, 2020 is a challenge for a lot of people. So we don't need necessarily to, you know, put out anything negative. I mean, there's enough already out there. So why not put out something positive and encourage and motivate and inspire people to do something better every day? You know, just improve who you were yesterday. You know, make a difference, make it matter. And, uh, you know, smiles yeah. are free. It doesn't <laughs> cost anything to, uh, you know, help and encourage others around you. Well, and what I think is so cool about that, that's always been my heart. You know, I've always been the positive, upbeat guy. I've been uh -huh. dealing in my local area. And then I started, then social media broke years ago, and I started, like, putting a little positive 
uh, blip on like Facebook and start getting all of this feedback, people, that it just affects their lives. You don't realize the impact of a positive word or a smile to someone, how big of an impact that is. So yeah. it's great with the technology to be able to then take that even further. And that's what I loved about you know, I never thought I would be an author. I never thought I'd be a podcaster. But all of a sudden, these things opened up themselves to me and to you and to other people to say, hey, we can actually encourage people everywhere, all across the world. Absolutely. Absolutely. And the reality is, uh, if, you're, if you're wondering if you're able to do it, and you're thinking you may want to do it, or you're considering something, just get started. Because once the momentum starts, and once you start moving towards something, and you have a goal and an idea, the motion that you take and the momentum that you build is is what's going to continue to, to allow you to move forward. And it's really about the idea of what is what is holding me back? You know, it's, it's, it's not the technology because it's easier now than it ever has been. And it's usually just, you know, the chatter inside your head. And so starting is the, is the first step. And, you know, you may get down the road and say, well, it's not really for me. However, don't regret not trying. Regret the fact that you, you know, it don't have that regret, you know, move forward. Test think, it out. Try it. Experiment. I think, I think you and I are twin brothers in mind because <laughs> I was just on I was just on a podcast last night. I think I said those same words. It's interesting because in my book, I give five steps to connection, my five uh -huh. easy and the first one is start because people don't get started. I always talk about positive forward motion, about um, just getting out there. I had a great um, professor at Oregon State where I graduated uh -huh. from, and she would just say, just do the next dumb thing. Just yeah. do something. If you get stuck or you get writer's block, just do something and you work yourself out of it. You get that momentum going. Get around positive people that lift you up. And it's amazing what you can do. And so that is just like, yeah, life is really momentum. And yeah. life is really about, yeah, not worrying about failing because like John Maxwell, who I love says, fail forward. Okay, we just keep making mistakes, but it's okay. You know, yeah, you just make it's mistakes. Fine. You just keep going. It's fine. And the re and Russ, you know, we've also had this same conversation on the Pyre broadcast, I think, is is the idea that you know, we don't always know what the outcome is going to be. However, we always know what the outcome is going to be if we do nothing. Right. And it's going to be zero. It's not, you know don't allow yourself to stay stagnant, you know, just try things, experiment. Your know, life is an instrument. It's just like any other instrument. You got to practice it. You got to be involved in it. You have to be engaged in it. And that's what really brings the wealth in your life and the attitudes that you bring to the table, the experiences that you have during your life and the people that you hang around with and, and the positive nature that you can it's ripple effect and oh, it yeah. comes both directions. So yeah, yeah. put it out there and, and see it return. Yep. No, you are so right. I mean, it is, it's, we don't even realize the effect we have on people. And, yeah. you know, there's some people that are just completely stuck. They're yeah. completely befuddled. And I've heard that somewhere before, but you yeah. know, it's amazing. Somebody should write a book on that. huh? That's a great idea. Wow. <laughs> thank you. I'll think about that. <laughs> just live the life you choose. Right. That's it. I think that's that's a book too. I, actually, I think my next book is going to be discombobulated because uh, I figured I'd go from befuddled to discombobulated. You know, but anyway. <laughs> hey, yeah. listen, I I love talking to you, Russ. But believe it or not, podcast time. We are out of time. Uh, we're going to leave them wanting more, and the way they're going to find out more is by contacting you. How do they do that? Just reach out to me on any social media. RussJohns.com is a place that I, I hang out a lot. And uh, if you want to, if you want to have a conversation, go to bookrust.com and book a call. That'd be awesome. Yeah. Well, I, I'd say I really enjoyed it. You're so easy to talk to and um, I just appreciate you. I really do. Likewise, Russ. Appreciate it. Thank you.
So listen, thanks everybody for tuning in today. You know, I really try to bring value to your life. I know that Russ added value to me today. And so I hope that this information and a positive outlook on life gives you a good perspective to move forward today and to make it a great day. And until we see you again, have a great day and a great life. We'll talk to you later. Bye-bye. Take care. Thanks for joining us for this week's episode of Marketing with Russ, a.k.a. hashtag Russ Selfie. Be sure to subscribe in your favorite podcast app so that you don't miss a single episode. Have an amazing day.